everyone, welcome back to my channel. I know people are gonna be like, girl, you never post. And it's true, but I'm getting better. I, I'm posting now again, so it's okay. But today, today, this week I woke up at 5 a.m. every day. I did five days, not seven days. I did like the school week. So I hope you all enjoy. I honestly thought it was such a great challenge. I'm filming this intro after I've finished the challenge and I'll get straight onto the video. But before I do, if you guys could like and subscribe, I would really appreciate it so much. We're all already at like five, five, nine or something. And it's crazy. Morning, everybody. Yay, it's 5 a.m. I'm just so excited to be getting up right now. I actually can't even open my eyes. Like, it's a bit of a problem. It took me ages to get sleep last night when usually it doesn't take me that long. So, it's 5.04 right now. I'm gonna get my Apple Watch and show you the time. takes it and it's my favorite. I'm about to go to school. I didn't really get to record anything else this morning because my mornings are so busy. Today was successful, 5 a.m. workout done, so I only have four days left. Oh. So I'm looking a little bit rough because it's the end of the school day, but I just want to say, excuse the fact that I have no personality in the mornings. Like, the Shannon you see in the mornings is not the same Shannon in the afternoons. I just have no personality and I look like I'm going through a midlife crisis. So if you're looking at these clips of me getting up at 5 a.m. being like, <laughs> This looks depressed. It's because sometimes sleep deprivation really changes who you are as a person. And you know what? That's okay. Because it's worth it for the gym. Because the gym at 5 a.m., that's the only time I can go now that I'm back at school. So it's my only alone time for me working on me. Well, I got really deep really quick. quick body shower now i'm home from the gym really sweaty so i need to have a quick body shower and then i'm gonna get breakfast and but that i did an arm workout like an upper body workout and i did two miles on the treadmill Day two was successful. I'm gonna show you guys my school fit because I kind of I'm kind of vibing with it today. <laughs> so it's these um also low-key abs showing through. I did an arm workout today, I might still have a bit of an arm pump. <laughs> oh what was that? A rose quartz crystal bracelet from a crystal shop so I can attract Day three today, and I'm scared because it's really dark outside right now. <laughs> Eat 
everybody, day three. I'm just adding in my apple to my porridge. I'm lucky loving my hairstyle today. It's very cute. It's literally just a claw clip clipped into my hair and then my curtain bangs are pulled back. I'm, I'm loving it. My fit check is black jumper, black coat and flares. My slider door's open and my whole neighborhood definitely heard all that, but like, I mean. All I literally did today in the gym was walk on the treadmill on a 10 incline for 30 minutes on speed three because I just could not do anything. Like this was definitely the hardest day. I found it so hard to wake up. I almost fell back asleep. I fell back asleep for like five minutes and then I woke up and I was like, oh my gosh, am I after missing my time to get up? And then it was like only five minutes later and I was like, whoa. But my muscles in my legs are so sore. I definitely pushed myself too hard yesterday doing legs because I upped my weight like a good bit, especially for squats and Russian deadlifts. So I was like, well, if it isn't the consequences of my own action. This is how I left my room this morning. Clearly not mentally stable. Clearly does not have her life together. It is officially the last day. So that was the last day of the challenge. I'm actually kind of sad that it's over. I'm gonna try and continue getting up at five every morning. Usually I was getting up at like three to four days a week at five to go to the gym. And this is the first time I've been able to go five days in a row. Like I'm so proud of myself. And even in school, I felt like I was able to concentrate so much better after I'd done like a morning workout and like had a proper morning routine. And I just felt like really focused and studious and just, amazing so guys that is it for the video i hope you guys really enjoyed it honestly i really enjoyed it like i said in the previous clip it made me so much more productive and just helped me with school and just even my workouts like i thought i'd be like not as good at working out in the mornings because i'm like tired and stuff but honestly like i recommend and also the gym is really empty at that time it starts to get busy with students at about half six so i finish my workout about quarter to seven so i 100 percent recommend going that early because if you go after school sometimes the gym can be so busy and there's no equipment so i actually flew through all my workouts because there was like so much equipment but i hope you guys really really enjoyed this video and it motivates you i love you guys and i hope you enjoy the video this was such a bad heart